All right, guys, so come on in. As you see right here, we created this dome, making a nice foyer entry into this part of the basement. As we enter here into the bathroom, you see all our lights are on auto sensors. In this area here, we have a sauna, fully equipped. Adjacent to that, we have a steam room, also serves as a shower. And of course our vanity. And we kept the bathroom private. Of course the light goes on, everything is on a light sensor and it'll shut off when we leave. So that someone could use the bathroom while other people are still using the sauna or the steam room. All right guys, so as you exit the bathroom right here, you're gonna see we're back at the entrance to the basement, which is located close to the bathroom uh, for using it for parties and whatnot. As you see, we got a custom built bar here you, please take notice of all the detail and the craftsmanship of the ceiling. Everything here is custom built and we built around all our appliances which is a keg later, dishwasher. Um, a lot of fine details here in all the woodwork. All these doors are handcrafted and built. We don't purchase anything. Even some of these silly things here where we have a little column, we use it for accent storage. So we're trying to utilize every inch of the bar and make it you know as fancy as possible. So in this bar area we also incorporated a shuffleboard table and just off to the bar over here we have what we're doing is a little card area. So we're in the process of restoring this vintage uh, poker table and then we wanted to complement that with you know the billiards table, pinball, and as you swing through here you'll notice that we have a little concession stand that we built as the entrance into the home theater. All right guys, so welcome into the home theater. You see an iPad mounted on the wall right here. This is a theme throughout the house because it is a smart home and all the technology is integrated into the iPads as well as into all the iPhones. So as you enter in here, um, obviously so we followed the theme of all the custom woodworking throughout all the walls and the custom fabric panels. This particular theater has two risers and it has uh, capability of 13 seats. As you, we even have the shadow box moldings and you know recessed lighting. Over here we have a hidden panel, uh, which is where we store all the DVDs. It can be used for anything. The speakers are all hidden within the walls, and this is a perforated screen, and the speakers are hidden behind the screen as well. We added a little stage here. It's more for decorations because really this area doesn't have a lot of use, but it gives you a nice look. So as, we, so as we come through the rest of the basement here, you see we have a very big open concept gym here. This particular gym is set up as a CrossFit gym, so we have everything from a watt clock and every component that you could possibly need, you know, mats on this side, uh, pull-up bars, we built this custom trophy cabinet, and then right here we have our party up section uh, with a TV. Interesting thing is because we have this technology with smart home, I can stream whatever I want on this TV. For instance, if I wanted a, an instructional workout video or, or if we were watching just something, anything that we have on our phone, we have uh, capability to stream on this TV or any other TV in the house as well. All right guys, this is the entrance from the home. As you come down these stairs, to the left here, we have a hair salon. And there's actually a little sitting area here outside the hair salon. So let me take you in here. Again, lights are all on sensors, so they turn on and turn off when we enter and exit. But this is set up, again, no TV. We have uh, a hair uh, sink right here and one workstation as a salon. So as we exit the hair salon, just to the uh, right over here, we have uh, a bedroom, which can be used as a bedroom or an office. And of course, to make it comply legally with the township, uh, it's required that we put what we call an egress window here. Basically another form of escape is what we All right guys, so here is the entrance from the home. I'll take you up here. Everything here is custom built. These railings were custom made. And what we did here that was kind of interesting is we actually took down this wall and added a full glass allowing a lot of light to come in to the basement as well as to the first floor of the home. And as you swing around here, you have our signature glass French door at the top of the stairs inviting you from the home into another level of your house, which is our finished basement. Guys, thank you very much for taking this tour of me in my custom finished basement. I hope you enjoyed uh, all the workmanship and craftsmanship that went into this. 
the biggest uh, part about stuff like this is the design process, which most people don't realize. That's something that we're very good at. We've designed and built over 3,000 basements. So to do more work like this, visit my website at patgagliano.com or my YouTube channel also at patgagliano. Thank you once again.